Welcome back! It's been a little bit of a while since I last made a UFO report and uh, story. So uh, we are doing a March uh, story and the news which has been happening for the latest time. And uh, I hope you can join me on uh, YouTube and subscribe to my channel and help me out so you can give more money and get this monetized so you can help more people and enlighten more people and also join my Patreon. I was looking through my Patreon uh, page. There is uh, drawings, information, channelings poems, uh, words of wisdom, art from 2017 up to now so I just I couldn't get through everything and support me there there's uh, uh, subscriptions from uh, one dollar and up to yeah ten and more so hope you can join me and uh, we are giving most of the money to uh, charity every fourth month and uh, for April I am thinking about giving to Turkey because of the earthquakes and also more to Ukraine you know and they need it to help the people there in the warring stage they are in so I feel you know the UFO extraterrestrial stuff it's not only about, you know, where they come from and their their spaceships and the technology. It's also about us. It's also about us becoming more nice and uh, and uh, kinder to each other. You know, because there's a lot of problems and ego on this planet, and uh, you can only start to look inside yourself, and then you will find a lot of surprises. And don't tell me anything else. And uh, one of the news uh, for March 2023 is of course the delayed UAP report, which I have here. So I have printed it out. There it is. I kind of used it as a mouse mat for some time. That's, that's just... Uh, how the importance of it I think and you can see here a total of 510 UAP reports are currently catalogued so that's quite a lot but you know it doesn't you know show the UFO reports which has been catalogued for hundreds of years and you know documented and we have drawings and we have yes there's just so much evidence you know you can't drown yourself in UFO evidence if you want. So, but you know, they are at least acknowledging and acknowledging that uh, it's real for the second time. It's the second report. Oh, so yes, I have a visitor here, my feline the little warrior. Come here. Come here. No, he doesn't want to. Yes, he doesn't want to. <laughs> he doesn't want to show himself. Okay, that was that, the UFO report. The second one, you know, UFOs are real, you know. Do you want to show himself now? Yes, he wants to show himself. Oh, hello, <laughs> my feline warrior. So, and... There was this uh, incident of the three UAPs uh, being shot down. No, 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 no. So this is you know, a, a report with some a little bit of cat influence. The three UAPs shot down. 
and here is a map of it and as you can see you know uh, they haven't told us very much about it but there are some inside info that they have uh, reclaimed the wreckage and also to classify it from uh, different uh, uh, channels we're not going to go into that who has uh, said that they have captured the UFOs or found the wreckage but that is out and uh, as we say see here is Alaska Yukon and Great Lakes so Canada has custody over one of the UFO UAPs and uh, for the fourth news there is a James Webb telescope we have these pictures here the first picture is of a uh, large Magellanic cloud. It's a uh, Doradus star formation. It's one of the biggest star formations that we know of. Close to us. And we have the Ice Age project where they map ice, or as you can see here from the picture. And we also have the picture number three Pandora Galaxy Cluster. So it's a uh, a picture of a galaxy cluster from the JS5 telescope and uh, now we have some UFO live uh, pictures the first uh, video is from uh, Pula Poland in uh, 2023 And we also have uh, another one, which is old, it's from uh, 2012, and uh, it's from uh, UK. So here you can see the UFO uh, whizzing uh, past. And... We have some uh, old uh, UFO pictures, uh, history, just to move back a little bit and show that, you know, the UFO uh, theme or uh, uh, the UFO uh, visitors have been here for a long time. And we have drawings and we have sketches. And uh, here are some of them.
And now we're going to try to channel something and see if we can get some information what is going on. I give She go. Come human, we, as you know us, for the theater Ricky Glee, we are now visiting your planet with approximately 17 ships. We have a broad band connection. High frequency with this one. He is one of us in another time. We have a loose connection. We just want to say that you are disclosure in your. You are disclosuring in your time now has been prophetical by the Arcturians and many others. It is happening, there are evidence, there are conflicts inside your governments and your agencies about what to disclose, but it is happening frequently and there are new plans of giving out new information for the public as it can't be denied anymore as we as many other star fearing races are in the skies showing themselves there is no use of denying what is going on it is time to tell the truth it is time for humanity to go on it is time for humanity to grow it is time to unite stand together peacefully and not like a warlike society it is time to open your hearts it is time to develop your conscious it is time to develop your consciousness and to raise up to high frequency so you all can live in peace with each other with the earth with the animals with us with everybody which are visiting you there are of course pirates there are of course warlike beings in the dimensions in the universes but for most part we are peaceful we have some experiments we have some hybrids which we have created along 
with help from you human societies to strengthen the bonds between us. They know it's true. These are coming more and more down to your earth, to your planets to help you to develop the clairvoyance of your children, of your humanity. We are slowly upgrading this one. This one has gone a lot through a lot. He's still going through a lot. There are something which needs to be shed, which has to be let go of to claim to rise in frequency. It is tough, it is hard. Many of us have been here too. It's not easy. It's a challenge, it's a masterful challenge for many of you. He is on the tip of the spear. Someone has to be the pioneers to show you the way and go through the pain which some in your humanity and others have given to you. You have to be the plow which shows the way to the brighter times, the light, the love which exists in you. The light which shines in all of us. I am Seta Ellor. I am one of our leaders. I am here to tell you that you are on your way to becoming a very important part of this universe, of this time, and that you're growing now as a human race. You're shedding your darkness. There are turmoils going on. There are infights. There are struggle for power structures, but in the end, you all will come to the conclusions that love and peace and unity is the only way to develop yourself to a higher race. As you will become, as you are in all the quantum realms. You are here to experience this, to grow. We are around, we are in a wider aspect, a wider broadband of frequency simultaneously. We can be around you at the same time be other places because we are more and higher and wiser and more developed as you also will be in due time. You are just experiencing a fragment of yourself because you wanted to be here now to help and to experience what it is to be human and how it is to learn to shed and to develop and rise yourself to new levels of awareness. You wanted to be the experience. We love you. We have many of our on your planet, many of our hybrids, and we will meet you one day. And then we will cherish each other. And we will live in peace. We will live in hope with each other. We will live in unity, in galactic peace. And this will be seen as a learning phase, a time where we all united for one common goal which is peace and love. While the darkness gave up their struggle and came back to the light again. Much love and remember you can always do things 
a better way, a more loving way. Nay, you.